Hi, my name is Jolene. I am the Refractive Coordinator here at Cape Fear Eye Associates. Uh, tonight we hosted a uh, public outreach program to educate patients on the iLASIK program. Um, it is the most advanced technology on the market today. We are the only office in Fayetteville that does uh, offer iLASIK. iLASIK is a leading technology for all laser custom LASIK. At Cape Fear Eye Associates, we're excited to be able to deliver this technology to you and your families. With LASIK, how exactly do we make the vision better? It's basically a three-step process. The first process involves a preoperative examination. This is a key step in order to allow us to determine if each person is a candidate, as well as what kind of treatment is involved for that patient. Steps two and three involve the surgery. The intralase is what we use to make the corneal flap for LASIK. The intralase is the leading femtosecond laser in the world in terms of number of procedures performed as well as the outcomes from those procedures. We're excited to have the FS60 intralase and this has been shown to be one of the fastest lasers as well as one of the most effective lasers around. Uh, we're just gonna, it's gonna show you the different steps involved in a LASIK procedure. So this is just basically a uh, the wave scan, a picture of the visual imper imperfections of the eye. And when light is reflected into the eye and bounces back, a machine called the wave scan helps capture that. And this image right here is one unique set of uh, measurements of an eye to show the different topography or shape of an eye so that the laser can treat it. This is the intralase, which will help uh, create a flap which in turn will allow the uh, surgeon to perform the procedure afterwards. So How we, does that work? Yeah, so you get uh, Valium, which is an oral relaxing medication. You're not going to be out of it because we, we want you to follow a little tracking. Scary. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you're, you put on accelerator. Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's understandable. Sometimes uh, it's easier to go through not knowing a lot than knowing more. Yes, bo both eyes can be done at the same time. That's actually how we do um, the vast majority, you know, unless there's any reason to treat one eye and wait on the second if there's any concerns. Usually, you know, you go home that day, we, whether you have LASIK or the variant of it called PRK, we want you going home that day and relaxing. The, the more you rest and, you know, sleep, close your eyes, not reading or doing a lot of other things, the better you're going to heal because your eyes get drier right away. So closing the eyes winds up being a, a good way to lubricate the eyes in addition to putting the tears in. So by the next day with LASIK, people are usually seeing a, a whole lot better. Now, it's not some people are great the next day. Some people who are drier take a little bit more time. With PRK, it takes a, a bit longer. We, we say about six weeks on average for your stable point. Some people get there a little bit quicker. So, certain patients a little bit slower if they have a bigger prescription. but. Um, that you have to take a little more downtime, usually about five, five, six days. Okay. Yeah. During the consultation, it is about two to three hours long uh, dilation. There is several tests and measurements that we'll do to get a good picture of your eye overall, inside and out. Um, we take measurements of your cornea and your refraction to see where you where you stand with your prescription. Um, the thickness when we do the corneal thickness is where uh, Dr. Patel or one of our other surgeons will then determine if you are a good candidate for the LASIK or the PRK along with some of the other test results. Mm. Are we ready? Yeah. Do you want to pick up? Go ahead. Okay. Drum roll. Don't hate me if I don't pick you. <laughs> Richard Howard is the winner for our free eye LASIK procedure.